Timmy was so thoughtful to order flour. I hadn't realized that I'd almost run out. And it's impossible to make banana bread without flour. And now, from Big Bad Bakery Broadcasting, Banana Bread Binge, a new show dedicated to all things banana bread. Ooh, my show's on! <laughs> What's wrong with the TV? I want the banana bread show, not some dumb documentary on monkeys. <laughs> well, really, a filthy monkey. Go away. <laughs> Who are you? Where am I? I'll have you know that I am no ordinary monkey, brother. I am king of all apes! Beware, king ape! The television is talking to me! It's never done that before! Heed me, O oh king! These humans consider themselves more evolved than you, and will attempt to enslave you. But it is your destiny to rule them. Make of this world what you will! My destiny? To rule? But should I believe everything I hear on TV? But beware, one shall come to overthrow you with one sandal, a lion-shaped birthmark, and a silly pink hat. Well, the hat at the very least. Human female, do you know of this pink-hatted warrior? My son Timmy wears a pink hat. Then you shall come with me. If this pink-hatted warrior attempts to overthrow me, I will overthrow you! Throw you over! Uh, a wall or something. Wait. Well, it won't be pretty, I don't mind telling you. Oh, no. Mom's been kidnapped by a super-evolved ape king who needs to practice his threats. And Dimsdale has been turned into an ape world by TV magic. Oh, uh, how will we get our banana bread now? I mean, we better rescue Mom and get that magic flower back. This is where the apes take their prisoners. What apes? Where? Why? It's TV magic, Cosmo. An ape documentary got mixed with other shows, and now they've become real. And an ape captured my mom. So we've come here to rescue her. But now we need rescuing. How embarrassing. Don't worry, Cosmo. These apes may be highly evolved, but they're dumb enough to leave this crate here. Human child. Who you calling human? It's an ape! Don't let him out! You can't free me. We political prisoners are imprisoned in extra sturdy metal cages. Political prisoner? What happened? We recently acquired a new king, but he's paranoid. It was prophesied that a small boy with a silly pink hat would oust him from his throne. That's why this place is under a hairy form of martial law. He created new laws to protect himself. And any ape who speaks out is imprisoned. He also captured my mom. Now I've got two evils to put right. The Tyrant King's headquarters are behind the giant ape in the temple. You must find a way to open the statue. That sounds exciting! The monkeys will help you. They hate the Tyrant King because he rations bananas. Remember the Rebel Force's password? Back to bananas! Back to bananas! Back to bananas! Back to bananas! gonna work. Maybe these pads are tuned to simian DNA. <laughs> that seems likely. <laughs> One down, two to go. There's a star in this cage. And a monkey. Ah, what did that ape say? Back to the Bahamas. Back to bananas, Cosmo. We'd better free the monkey. 
This cage looks weaker than the metal type. Try climbing on it and bouncing it. <laughs> you didn't stand a chance, little star. equals one wish. What do we need this time? An iron, my dancer Grease. The ape rebel leader mentioned hordes of ape guards. He said swarms. Either way, we need to distract them. How about bananas? It's well documented that apes can't resist bananas. What about a banana launcher? Even better, a portable banana entrapment deployment snare. I wish I had a banana launcher. You'll need to collect bananas from banana trees. A banana launcher isn't as cool as a portable banana entrapment deployment dong doolop banana furnace. No, I can't even say it now.
available. Not for a kid with fairy godparents. Let's find stars and wish. There's a star in a cave. That's two green stars. They complement my natural skin tone. It's a monkey butler. He must work for the apes, training his dignity for bananas. Stand on him. That's humane. This kind, subservient monkey will take okay. I need super sticky wall climbing abilities. Like Sticky Lizard Man from your comics. He's in the League of Ineffectual Evil. I wish for Sticky Lizard powers. Wow, that's cool. Now you'll be able to climb vine-covered walls like a real lizard. You can also bask in the sun and run on hot sand. But I already could. playground for simians, an impassable barrier for ten-year-olds. Oh, I have an idea! Wanda thinks we can use the monkey wrench monkey to cross. How do you know that? Never mind. It's a great idea. If the poor little fella's arms hold out. Thank <laughs> you. 
has that statue. The Tyrant King must have created some fiendish mechanism to protect him. Ooh, check it out. Banana smelly meters. I saw those on TV. I don't get it. We should bounce those banana smelly meters. I bet that's how the statue is activated. Cosmo, I'm proud of you. That's a good thing, right?
you see that ape, don't you? seem to have some effect. What? That huge banana's moving! I didn't expect that! Quick, jump aboard! 
It may be our only chance. We gotta ride that giant banana. I've been waiting my whole life for this. Do not take my lands or my chattels or bondsmen or any of that stuff. Who do? I told you not to fight prophecy-fearing, super-evolved ape kings. But, Mom, I rescued you! Well, that's all that's stopping me from grounding you, young man. Now, where's my flour? I still have banana bread to bake. Um, the flour was spilled in the fight, Mom. You'll have to buy new flour. Typical. I guess a mother's work is never done. <laughs> spilled oh no what do we do take it easy cosmo i couldn't give the magic flower to mom i've got it right here good work timmy the show is over tv shows are dangerous when they become real but at least they end we better leave before we start to experience technical difficulties my vertical hole feels a little itchy <laughs> 